Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Hope you all are doing great and fine. So today we are going to look over the placement status of IIT Mandi's MTech VLSI and we are going to cover three batches like from 2020 to 2022. So we will also be covering the latest batch that is 2022. And I assure you that this data never been updated on the IIT Mandi's website itself and this video has organized every data for the placement in the IIT Mandi's MTech VLSI. And IIT Mandi itself has not covered the data of the placed students to their website so this video has covered everything with respect to placements of the mtech vlsi students as you all know mtech or ms in vlsi is going quite attractive these days just because it is the need of the era every new tech even you can take a machine learning ai data science evs every new tech is just chip based so there would be a huge demand for the hardware and vlsi people well vlsi industry is also famous among the young gen because it fetches really good packages salary packages in the industry even much higher than the IT sector so that's why I have decided to cover the salary package offered and the uh, companies visited in the IIT Mondays MTech VLSI for placements and I'm sure you will be amazed to look over the data of uh, salary package offered to the MTech people and along with this we will be having a basic insight of the placement scenario at IIT Mondays which it is following since its inception before starting I would love to convey that if you are liking my video then you can consider subscribing this channel and look over the content which I upload day to day. So without any delay, let's start the discussion. So IIT Mandi has its MTech VLSI program started in the year 2016 and since then they have passed like six batches and in the second year of MTech students can have their internship in the companies. So various companies have visited the campus. Uh, the topmost recruiters are the Cadence, AMD, Synopsys, NVIDIA, Qualcomm. So all of these companies have visited the campus. Let's start the discussion with that. So let's analyze this data. As you able to see, we have three batches from 2020 to 2022. And for the latest batch, that is 2022, uh, we have percentage placed students 86%. For 2021, it is 90%. And for 2020 batch, it is uh, 64%. So the maximum number of students uh, were placed in the 2021 batch. If we look over the data of PhD students, so no student has opted for PhD in the latest batch, that is 2022. But in 2021, there were 7% of students, those who had opted for PhD and similarly for 2020 batch 21% of students had opted for a PhD so it was the greatest number that is 28% and similarly if we see the percentage unplaced students for 2022 batch there are 14% and the previous batch that is 2021 there are, it is 3% and from the 2020 batch it is 8% so in the latest batch we have the 0% of students those have opted for PhD and the maximum number of unplaced students are also from the the latest batch so hopefully the leftover students may get their opportunity soon so it is really worth to mention here that one of the students from the 2020 batch has opted his PhD from the University of Delaware USA and he has been pursuing his PhD really well and from 2021 batch there are two number of students those have opted for the PhD from Kaust Saudi Arabia and they are also pursuing their PhD since then but yes, percentage of maximum placed students was best for the 2021 batch. And let us have the data of the packages and the companies which had visited the campus. So let's see the first five companies which had visited the campus for these batches. So these are Intel, Synopsys, AMD, Cadence and Texas Instruments. So the green color is for 2022 batch and that is the latest batch. And I have also written the strength of the students uh, that was enrolled for the MTech VLSI batch. And uh, for 2022 it was uh, 14 and uh, for the 2021 it was uh, tw uh, 29 and for the previous batch that is 2020 it was 11. So looking over this data, four number of students has joined Intel and five number of students has joined Synopsys and one number of student has joined AMD. Similarly, one number of student has been recruited by the Cadence and one has been recruited by the TI. So this is the data for 2022 batch and all of these students have joined these companies in various locations uh, that is from Noida to Bangalore, Delhi. If we look over previous batch that is 2021, Intel has hired one student only and no student from this batch were recruited by Synopsys. Three students uh, which is good number offered by AMD. So AMD is really good company and it is a really growing company. It has shown maximum growth with respect to revenue in the market and it is even higher than the Samsung and the Intel which are the semiconductor leaders in this market. Now looking over the data of the 2020 batch, we see Intel had two students and uh, they are working there till date and one student in Synopsys and uh, he was recruited for the 
design engineer profile and there were no students hired for amd for this batch and one number of students was recruited for cadence and again no students for texas instruments let me also tell that if any company has hired no number of students it means that that company has not visited the campus for the recruitment at all uh, in the respective year so uh, take this data as nil for that company so let's have a look upon the other companies and uh, these companies are nvidia qualcomm stm mediatek cermorphic and serum systems since there is no green color it means that none of the students from the latest batch has been recruited by these companies and uh, the orange color is for 2020 batch so it means three number of students were recruited by nxp and then rest of the figures are for the 2021 batch and all of these companies have recruited from 2021 batch maximum so one student had joined nvidia and three number of students had joined qualcomm and one for stm again one for mediatek and two number of students were recruited by the Sermorphic but both of them didn't join this company for their personal reasons again one student had joined Serum Systems so these companies had recruited maximum from the 2021 batch you must be thinking that why so much uh, good number of companies had visited the campus for 2021 batch so it was just because the number of students for 2021 batch was quite good and it was 29 and uh, the efforts of the whole IIT Mundi team was uh, really good and even placement coordinator of this batch re worked really hard to have the companies on the campus and so that from their efforts many companies had visited the campus and they had recruited the students because we are going to see how much companies really offer to the students who are opting for VLSI and the field VLSI itself is famous for the high range packages which I have already mentioned that is they are having the packages much more than the IT sector. So have a look upon the data of the 2021 batch and we are able to see I have mentioned different ranges like from 5 to 10 LPA, 10 to 15, 15 to 20 and 20 to 30, 30 to 35 and then 35 to 40. So for the 5 to 10 LPA, 12.5% of students were offered from uh, 5 to LPA and for 10 to 15 LPA only 2.5% of students were offered for 15 to 20 this is the maximum package offered and it is 33.3% and it was for Intel, AMD and MediaTek and for 10 to 15 LPA it was from Cadence and Intel and the next range is 20 to 30 LPA and uh, this much package was offered to 12.5% of students and it was from Cadence and then 30 to 35 this is really huge and it is 12.5% from Qualcomm and TI and it is worth mentioning here that Qualcomm is a company which pays really well to its employees and it is also growing at a very good pace in the field of uh, VLSI and semiconductors and if we see the maximum package range that is 35 to 40 LPA and it was offered to only 4.2% to students and it was for NVIDIA NVIDIA is famous for its GPUs and for gaming software we already know that AMD and NVIDIA are the market leaders so the, the NVIDIA offered the maximum package in the batch of 20 21. So 4.2% means there was only one student which had been offered this package uh, that is around 40 LPA. So we have looked over the packages from the uh, 2021 batch and it was really good packages which had been offered to the students. Now have a look upon the packages offered to the 2022 batch and this is the latest batch and uh, there are just two categories and those are 20 to 30 LPA and 35 to 40 LPA. So both of these ranges are really good and the students those have been given this number of package uh, they, are, they must be happy because this is really good package and uh, so we see for 20 to 30 LPA, 21.8% of almost 82% of students have been given this package and this is from Intel only and for 35 to 40 LPA, this is a, which is the maximum uh, package offered to this batch and it is from AMD and TI. So we see AMD and TI had given a little less package to the 2021 batch students but here it has won the situation and AMD and TI has given the maximum package uh, just because in this year AMD and TI both are growing really well which I've already mentioned like AMD is the most growing company uh, right now so 35 to 40 LP is a huge package which has been given to the latest batch and almost 19% of students has been give, given this much package so we have reviewed all the placement scenario in the IIT Mundi and whenever you are looking for the placements in the IIT Mundi this video has covered all the status from the last previous three batches and which are the important batches so we have covered the percentage students uh, which had been placed in the in these companies and 
एंड परसेंट इज अनप्लेसड स्टूडेंट्स एंड वी आर होपिंग लाइक द स्टूडेंट्स हु हैज नॉट बीन गिवन एनी अपॉर्चुनिटी दे विल बी गेटिंग प्लेसड इन दिस कंपनी सून एंड वी हैव आल्सो सीन सम ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स दो हैज बीन प्रसुइंग देयर पीएचडी फ्रॉम द वेल परफॉर्मिंग इंस्टीट्यूट्स और यूनिवर्सिटीज दे विल आल्सो परफॉर्म रियली वेल इन द अपकमिंग करियर सो वी विश ऑल द बेस्ट टू द स्टूडेंट्स एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो सो इफ यू हैव लाइक दिस वीडियो प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड यू कैन शेयर दिस वीडियो टू योर फ्रेंड्स हु आर लुकिंग टू जॉइन आईआईटी मंडी फॉर द एमटेक वीएलएसआई एंड हु हैव एन ऑप्शन टू जॉइन दिस इंस्टीट्यूट फॉर एमटेक वीएलएसआई सो थैंक यू सो मच फॉर हैविंग मी थैंक यू